here's another example of a formula. Let's say uh, you've got a, a triangle here. Okay. Uh, okay. Um, let's let's call this a uh, this length here b and this length here c. Well, the uh, the perimeter of this formula is given by a plus b plus c. Well, it does make sense, really. If, if you're an ant here, you've got to walk all the way across here, which is A, and then all the way down here, which is B, and then walk all the way up here, which is C. So basically, here's a formula for the, uh, for the perimeter, for the perimeter of this triangle. Okay? So now, if, if someone gives us, oh, um, A, uh, I've got a triangle, or when A is, uh, 5, and B, is uh, is let's say three and c c is uh, let's say seven. So what that means is that they've they've got a triangle where a is five, okay, and um, b is three, so it's quite short here, and c is is uh, is seven. So if you want to know the the uh, perimeter of this triangle here, just use a formula. P equals what's a? Well, a well, the formula is P equals A uh, plus, uh, this is B here, and then plus uh, C here. So, well, A A is this bit here, isn't it? Well, well, well actually, put put A here into into this thing here. So, this would be 5, okay, and, uh, and B, you put it into here. So, B is 3 here, and, uh, and C, put it into here. You're basically just... Just following the uh, the formula. The formula is this here. It's saying get a plus it to b and then plus it to c. So you're you're just following the formula. Sometimes you don't actually un need to understand the formula. You can just use it. So five plus three is uh, is eight uh, plus seven um, here. But basically, yeah. So now it's eight plus seven, which is fifteen. Basically, what I've done is. Uh, I've merged these two. That gives me eight. Um, I've taken seven down. Well, you can do it all in one go if you want. Just get five plus three plus seven all in one go, and it should be fifteen. Okay. Um, yeah. Okay.